this is Kayla Murphy from the Fabric Garden in Madison, Maine and FabricGarden.com. This is our first Facebook Live, so I hope you'll enjoy it and be a little forgiving if I do make some mistakes along the way. We chose to do what's called a tour of the store on our first Facebook because a lot of people know us from far away. They've never been here. Or if you're in this area or you're in Maine, Maybe you haven't made it in with the little stuff that's going around. So we're going to do a little tour and show you um, the store. But along the way, I'm also going to kind of stop and show you a couple of products. A lot of what I'm going to be actually showing you will be available on our website. Our website is www.fabricgarden.com. It's quite a nice website broken up into categories. The selection is quite nice. So first off, just give you a little bit of a history if you don't know our shop. We've been here since 1978, 42 years. We've seen a lot. We've seen a lot of errors and everything like that. Uh, my, my Aunt Mari, my sister and Beth and I started this back in 1978. They have passed, but we are still going. Um, and our second thing that we're pretty proud of, we're a Janome dealer. We've been a Janome dealer for 36 years. Um, we love our machines, we love sharing, so along the way I'm going to show you a little bit about that, that. So that's a little bit of history. I bet you, if I had to say, you might have made a mask or two over these last few months. I'd like to take a minute and show you some of our mask supplies. Now, if you look on our website, www.fabricgarden.com you will see a whole section mass supplies the first thing you will see or one thing that's kind of new and different is this fabric right here it's called BioSmart it's a good 60 inches wide it's a cotton fabric that when washed with chlorine it absorbs the chlorine back so it adds to, the, uh, to an antibacterial type uh, fabric so it's very nice. It's used a lot in medical garments, but now, right in here, made great for masks. If you're making masks, we also do have the lightweight iron-on interfacing on our website. Sometimes that's a little hard to find, but we have plenty of that if you go look on that. You need elastic. Who would have thought, other than toilet paper, elastic would be the crazy thing? So we do have elastic online. They're in five-yard hunks. Very soft, it's not a hard elastic, and we have it in many colors. We have the traditional quarter inch in black um, elastics, again in five yard hunks. We also have the nose guards. If you're gonna put them in your mask, those are the little metal bars, and they're 10 for 299. We do have some of the clips left to hold your elastic and adjust your elastic. Now, you say, how am I going to make this mask? You know, it's sometimes it's like I don't want to look at it. I don't want to look at a video. We have a wonderful, wonderful mask template. Very simple. Comes in three sizes. You can do actually a small, medium, and large size out of one template. It tells you exactly what size to cut your squares. You can use four squares. Two for the outside, two for the inside. And what I have right here is there's a small, medium, I'm going to do the large. So I have two squares right here. I'm just going to lay my ruler right on top of my fabric so the two edges are even. And then I'm just going to cut around, use your rotary cutter, and one, and line that up, two. So it's as easy as that. So now we have, it's easy as that if you press a little bit. Okay, so you have that ready to go. And it's going to sew up the middle and make part of the, fa part of the face mask, just like that. The pattern also tells you exactly how much elastic to cut. So there's no guesswork. It'll say how much to cut. So that's a great thing. We, this is a very popular face mask template or ruler from Creative Grids. We like them. They have a nice quarter inch seam allowance. So again, where are you going to get that template? FabricGuard.com. They'll send it right to you. 
Now, yesterday, I was very excited. I saw a box come in, and I knew what was in that box. And I want to share this with you. This is actually Maine fabric. This is from a fabric that has the actual state of Maine, the little star, the pine tree state. So this is out of a state collection, and we have this fabric available online and also in the store. So I said, you know what? Luckily, Sue was working. She's a quick one with the masks. We made up a simple little state of Maine mask. We use the mass, the state of Maine fabric on the outside, cotton, broad cloth, solid on the inside. So that is part of mass. The last two things I want to share. Some of these companies are making mass panels, and the panels are pre-printed. This is a Ruby Star one from Moda. So you can cut. And that would be the outside, you'd line it with something else. So we have the rounded and the square masks. And also, right in here, fun, fun, fun mask panel. So those are our mask panels that we have. So this is part of our mask supplies. It's been a crazy time. We all know that. You know, luckily we're all getting through it. We're all supporting each other. But just don't you think sometimes you wish you could get away Get away to a beach, a nice sunny beach with the ocean going. Well, I'm going to show you the second best thing. This is a line of fabric from Hoffman we just got in. This is called Shoreline. It's really tranquil, very nice. This is a panel that you're going to see. And they're these are digitally printed. They're very big panels. You can use them as pillows. You can use them in your quilts and, and uh, piece around them. But they have the beautiful lighthouse, you know what that is. Um, the sandpiper, the seahorse, and things like that. So this is a big panel. We have the coordinates right in here. The lighthouse, beautiful water. Little sandpipers, similar. Nice little sailboat. So this is a great new collection. And again, you can find it online at fabricgarden.com. I'm going to continue. A lot of the fabrics in this, what we call the front wall, are going to be a lot of our newer fabrics. Um, again, beautiful florals from Hoffman, dragonflies, fun, fun, fun. This is from Moda Swirly Girl, which is the little, little squirrels, the little pumpkins right in here. Great stuff. You're going to see cut goods, but also online. Some bright, some of the ever popular sunflowers. We also have beautiful fall fabrics, and they're going to be rich jewel tone colors. We do have some fun novelties of the little trailers. This has been nice this year. It's a very subtle fall. You know, the beautiful chickadee and pine cones, and it's frosted with silver. So nice array of fall fabrics. Probably one of the sections that's closest to my heart that I love a lot is the Bally or Batik section of fabrics. Celia is going to just show us what a section is. They're all arranged by color. We have the tonal 1895s, the prints, um, all in here. Beautiful, many, many, a couple of thousand bolts at least. Also in this section, we have what's called the Moda Grunge fabric. I like it because it's a very textured blender fabric, very similar to your 1895s from Hoffman and many, many colors available also in the grunge. We're going to talk about this a little later, but we also have grunge wide backs that I'm going to show you. But that's all our regular 45 inch grunge. In this area also, we do have rayon batiks. Now rayon batiks are printed the same way as batiks. They're just going to be much softer. They're used for nice clothing, drapey garments. So that's our rayon batiks. One of the most popular things now in the boutiques is all the tonal um, berry creams and whites. Usually you can never have too many. You, they were hard to come by the light, light, light background or blender boutiques, but now we're having a lot more of those. So in this little area, these are our patterns. 
Our patterns, again, are nicely organized on our website, fabricgarden.com, under the pattern section. So we do everyday pricing on patterns, 20% off. These are in, all these are in store. There is a selection online. So these are definitely part of our patterns. In store, we do a lot of fat quarters. You know what those are, 18 by 20 pieces of fabric folded up. So you see a lot of fat quarters in the boutique section, but you'll also see them different areas and genres uh, in the racks here for, for fat quarters. So we've been talking a little bit about fabric, but maybe you don't want to cut out your own fabric. Maybe you say, I don't want to cut these strips up. So we have what's called cut goods. Cut goods are pre-cut fabrics that are either two and a half inch strips like a jelly roll, a five inch charm square, a fat quarter pack. So we have a nice selection of what we call cut goods. Again, on our website, category, cut goods. One in particular I'd like to share with you today is I love Moda Three Sisters. Very soft, soft, appealing colors. This is the new line Daybreak. This is a kit right from Moda. It's 64 by 80. And it'll have the directions and all the fabrics you need. So you don't have to go running around looking for uh, exactly the same kind of fabrics. So Three Sisters kit, Daybreak, again online. We also have fat quarter packs. People love these. You can make whatever you like. So this is one fat quarter out, out of the whole line. We also have charm squares and jelly rolls. So that's kind of how a collection goes. You'll have a little bit of different sizes to choose from. So we're going to exit cut goods and we're going to come right down into this section. This section is a lot of our, what we call traditional fabrics. These are Kansas Troubles by Moda. A lot of these are very popular. Uh, Lynn makes these, uh, designs these fabrics and good blender traditional fabrics in this section. Lots of blenders up top too. Down in here, it's getting cold. I don't know about, well, we're, we're in Maine. So, you know, it hit 30 already and we had snow the other morning. So these are actually flannel fabrics, beautiful Moda soft flannels. We also have a nice selection here and down this alley right here for plenty of nice Moda plaids, prints, woodsy, children's, and, and so on. Down in this middle area, I, we have a lot of panels. <laughs> panels are pre-printed. You can put them in the middle of the quilt. You can cut them up and strip them. But we have a lot of panels. And we were like, where are we going to put all these so people can see them? So a couple of years ago, we designed this rack. I, I kind of call it like my clothing rack where I can kind of just flip through. These are all uh, panels that are split up by sections. So wildlife, holiday, children, seaside, and so on. You can actually look through and you'll see the panel, the new moose, and you'll have it ready to grab. So these are in store. There are some online also at fabricgarden.com. Two ones I'd like to share. This is a very popular fall one that we have from Timeless, and we do have some coordinates. This one right here, lovely P and B. This has the um, just keep going. Keep going. Um, this one. Sorry about that. You know how they say technical difficulties. It's still technical difficulties, but we're going right on. So here is another panel that we have. I love this one with the skater, the little pine cone, the little robin. And I'm going to show you a little coordinating fabrics a little bit later. So this is how our panels go. And again, at fabricgarden.com, under fabric, you can go to fabric panels. So that's going to give you um, a whole selection of all our panels. And another section that we have in this area that is kind of fun. We make a lot of samples. You're going to see as we go around the store, you're seeing samples hang everywhere. You're going to see uh, quilt pat, uh, quilts, wall hangings, and so on. After we make them, we actually sell a lot of our samples. We do donate to some of the organizations, but we do sell a lot of them. In the back area, right in here, you're going to see some of our quilts that we have for sale. 
and they're all uh, m most of these are on the website. I think she's so they're 100% cotton, good quality, all quilted and things like that. A little bit over here, see these fabrics right in this section? This is our sale area. We always like to have a little sale area, nice to have a nice fabrics. They start at $3.99, so there's always something I think she got it. that you can, you know, get a nice value on. So let's continue along. We talked about traditional fabrics, right? The Kansas Troubles. Love them. If I go a little bit further down here, you're going to see a more traditional. These are our laundry basket. You know that name. In the pinks and the blues and some motor fabrics. I'm just going to touch, touch on this little quilt here. This is a beautiful motor quilt. Next Wednesday, November 11th, we're going to do a Facebook Live with live ordering right on the web, right on Facebook. So I'm going to talk about a little bit more of this next Wednesday. So we're heading down another section. This particular section, nice and cheerful light and airy, nice 1930s fabrics if you wanted to do some little hexy or little children's patterns and things like that. Then as we head down the alley here, we are the fabric garden, so we do have a lot of flower fabric or floral fabrics. You're going to see different groups. These are the beautiful new pansies from Timeless. Um, you're going to see some of the chickadees and the florals, nice bright ones. So in this section here, going to have traditional florals and then you're going to get into some metallics that have uh, florals with metallics and things like that. Over in this section, again, nice light and airy fabrics, cottons, traditional fabrics, and who does not like blue and yellow? Very popular group. A lot of motors, Andovers, uh, Marcus fabrics in the blue and yellow. We'll continue down a little bit more. So we went from floral to bright. We have some nice laurel birch fabrics, such as nice and bright, bright metallic groupings like that. We do have some cape, cape facet fabrics. And beautiful digital florals. You know, these are groups where it's amazing to see the clarity and colors in the fabrics. So in here and in here, we're going to have a nice digital fabrics. Now the holidays are coming. I can't believe it, but Christmas is coming. Or well, the holidays are coming. So what I want to show you here, this is one of our kits that we made. This is again under fabricgarden.com. If you go to kits, festive chickadee, birdhouse quilt kit, this is going to be there. So you can order it online or obviously come in and see this. It's a beautiful panel and we chose some nice soft colors and use the same beautiful chickadee fabric for the back. So this is things we make up ourselves and make the kits so they're ready for you to cut and sew. Speaking of holiday, we have a couple of different genres. We have the traditional chickadee right in here. We have fun, fun, bright Christmas. We have traditional, again, this is adorable for Moda, the little sheep, the little tree, little chickadees. So fabrics like that. Now, again, kind of like my fun stuff. These are what I would call a lot of the metallic Christmases. And a lot of them are the metallic Hoffman fabrics. The chickadee with the soft silver um, accents. So these would be your, your uh, most of the metallic fabrics in traditional colors and the frost blue. Now remember the panel I showed you back, back there, the Winter Wonderland? So here was the panel, but a lot of times there's matching fabrics. This is a beautiful stripe. You can make the stripe runner if you'd like. That's an easy project. All over print with the sled, the mittens, nice focal fabric like that. Then you have coordinating silvers and the snowflakes. So a lot of times the panels will have coordinating fabrics, which is quite nice. So we're done Christmas in this section. Now we're going to head into a little bit of the woodsy area or traditional. This group we're going to follow a little bit with Christmas. This is Moda Christmas and Holly Taylor Christmas 
ever so popular. Um, the trees and the little uh, bridge like that. Fun, gnomes, red truck, more Christmas. I'm going to follow a little bit further and this is what I call real, the woodsy fabrics. People come in, you know, I want a moose, I want a bear, I want to have a landscape, things like that. So in here we have woodsy fabrics, very popular black bear. This just came in today, beautiful moose with the landscape. So we have woodsy, then patriotic. The patriotic fabrics, kind of, you know, your traditional stars and stripes, little fun little red truck, then with the traditional red, white, and blues in here. So I have talked and shown you a lot of prints, right? There's different groups, they might have a tonal or two, but we've seen a lot of prints. You might need a solid or a tonal, tone on tone type of print, to mix with what you have. So we're going to enter into the solid and tonal world. And in here, we have muslins and tone on tone and solid creams, white tone on tones, black, ever popular grays, black. And as we look right on down, you're going to see every color broken up, every color of the rainbow. So if you needed a fabric to match, you know, here's your tans, your yellows, you say, I really need a nice turquoise, a nice popping turquoise. Well, there you go. There's a nice choice for you, a nice choice for you. So in here, you're going to find most of your tonal fabrics and a little further down, all the solid fabrics. Mask making, people using solids like crazy. Many of the fabrics in this area, fabricon.com, blenders, solids and blenders. You go to that section, you're going to see what we have to offer. So great selection of solids and blenders. Now you might need something a little fun, particularly with the masks or children's quilts and things. This section right here is what we call the novelty fabric novelty because they're cute little things. You've got the little the little boots, you might have a little basketball, you might have, these are kind of fun, the first responder fabrics. So these are novelties. Also in this section over here, you will have some children's and uh, children's prints, kind of novelty prints and solids and dots. So I mentioned about the chickadee that we have kits. So I'll show you a little bit about our kits. These are kits that we offer. They're mostly in this section. So like that chickadee kit would be right in here. It's all packaged up for you, ready to go. So we do offer kits. And again, fabricgarden.com, kits. And you'll see what we have to offer. Or obviously, come on in. So these are our kits. So we have fabric. We've talked a little bit about fabric. We talked about the cut goods. You might need thread or notions, cutters, pins, and so on, to do your projects. I want to share with you Gutemann, the large size spool, and Arafil, beautiful selection of Arafil threads, online, always 20% off. That's something we do every day, along with our patterns and books that are 20% off. So, you know, there was a shortage of threads. You might have seen or heard that, but we're in, we're in good position. We're well stocked in threads and ready for in-store or online purchases. You might need some notions. And notions, I kind of oh, I have always called them the little doodads. You know, we have rotary cutters. We have cutters. We have uh, the ever popular quick clips, pins, markers, and so on. So we have a great selection of notions, and once you put your quilt together, your top batting, you need the batting. So our batting, we have a great selection of batting in cotton, poly, and the ever popular Katahdin battings. So they're right here, in store only on the batting. So along the way, you need, you made your quilt top, we have our batting. I love this little area. These in this whole area down here 
of what we call the wide back fabrics. Instead of buying six or nine yards of regular fabric, you can easily, this is 108 or 104 inch wide, so you need much less fabric. In wide backs, great selection of grunge wide back. Traditionals, we have muslins, we have the um, Stonehenge, we have Batik. So great selection of wide back fabrics. Because you might be needing to finish off a quilt. The notions also, we in store we have a great selection of rulers. Also, our books in store are 20% off, same as patterns and the threads. And we also carry the Deb Tucker line of rulers in the store, too. In a minute, I'm going to kind of talk a little bit about machines and embroidery machines. What's nice is you need embroidery threads. So we do carry the Janome embroidery thread singly or in the box. So we have fabric. We have thread, we have batting, we have the backing. So how'd you put it all together? Let me show you. So what we have here, I'm going to kind of go into my uh, newly expanded sewing machine area. So with COVID hit, we really decided to make this spread out and a nice easy way so you can sit and sew and not be all congested and things like that. So I'm going to take just a minute, if I could, and share with you a couple of things. Um, we have been a Janome dealer for 36 years. We also um, uh, have been a, an award-winning Janome dealer. Um, we've made 20, top 25 out of 700 in the country. And if you've been through COVID and you know what's happening, it's very hard to get sewing machines. Just like everything, everybody's home, everybody's sewing, things sold out. But I'm very happy to say we have good stock on our machines. Almost everything's in stock. I just received 30 machines yesterday. We're, we're hurriedly, excuse me, demoing out, so they're going to be there for you. So I'm going to go through the machines just kind of quickly, if you don't mind. Um, these are our regular, what I call seven-inch opening machines. We have mechanical machines. This is the ever-popular QVC line. This is the line of 14 pound lightweight but full size motor machines. This one I'm going to sew on just for a second. This is what's called the 4120. We do have it in stock. We can ship it. it the shipping, you would be charged for shipping, but it's $6.99. So let me show you what this is. This is a machine, and I have the option. This is a machine that does come with all your quilting feet. So it does come with your quarter inch foot, your walking foot, and so on. So I have just regular straight stitch on. It's a nice L LVC. LCD back flip screen so you can see it. I'm using my stop saw start so I don't have to use my foot pedal. We can go fast or slow. Now if I wanted to stop, you could easily stop. If I wanted to secure my seam, I could either reverse, but we don't want that showing. So what I want to do is lock my stitch which is press that button and the needle goes up and down and makes a lock. My needle's down, so if I had to pivot, I could. Last but not least, people love the scissor. Right here, give it a little cut. And right now, you have a beautiful ending with the tails on the other side. So it's a great machine, 120 stitches. It does come with lettering, so your quilt labels. It does come with the extension table. All your quilting feet, hardcover, very nice machine. So these are your regular size machines. What we can also talk about is, which has gotten quite popular since, I hate to keep saying that, but with masks and things like that, so you edging. These are sergers. These are sergers that will cut, sew, and overcast your fabric. So you have the raw edge, instead of turning it over or overcasting, this just goes right straight through. We have sergers of all different levels, and the ever-popular air-thread serger, super-duper-duper easy to thread on that. So, nice four different kinds of sergers. On back on machines, now we're going to get a little bigger. We're going to have bigger, 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 bigger. Right in here, these are the Skyline machines. They're going to have a, a nine-inch opening, bigger screens, auto-press-a-lifter, quite nice, auto-tension. 
This is the 6700, which is the next generation from the 66, which a lot of people know. We've had that for a long time. This machine here has a 10 inch bed, the uh, semi -pro professional, heavy duty, in here. This is Janome's top of the line we have, which is the 15,000. It is a combination machine, meaning you'll have sewing, quilting, and embroidery all in one. So it's all put together. This has an 11 inch bed, very nice big hoops, great screen, great light, great features. So that's a 15,000. I'm gonna scoot right over here for a second. Uh, once you have everything together, maybe you don't want to quilt on your domestic machine. Maybe you want to quilt on a long arm machine or semi long arm. We have the Janome Quilt Maker Pro 16. That's a 16 inch opening here, a five foot frame. So it's a little smaller footprint if you don't have a ton of space and things like that. But this and the 18 that I'm going to show you is both, they're both stitch regulated. So as you sew, your stitches stay consistent. So that's the whole thing about stitch regulation. This is the Quilt Maker Pro 16. Now we're going to go to the Quilt Maker Pro 18. 18 inches of space. It's only set up little here. This is a four foot setup. But the machine itself sets up for 12 feet. So you can just lay your layers and quilt again with the stitch regulation. Quilt Maker Pro 18. Now over here we have a few more machines. We talked about the 15,000 as being a combination machine. This is the 9850. And this one is actually a nine inch opening, two hoops, combination machine. So again, you could quilt, sew, and overcast. Uh, quilt, quilt, sew, and embroider. So let's say you have a machine. You're really happy with your sewing machine or your quilting machine. You just got it, you love it. I want to embroider. So what we have to offer is an embroidery only machine. So this would sit next to or somewhere in your sewing room and you can actually bring in your designs or pick your designs that are in here and embroider only. That's what that machine's gonna do. You can embroider individually your blocks or we're actually doing a quilt as you go kind of block in here. So this is the 550E embroidery only. We have just a few more that I'll show you. This is the Mimicraft 9450, super duper popular for quilters. You kind of want to get one nice machine, you know, you trade it up. This is an 11 inch opening, the great screen, so that you can see the great light, the auto lift, the cutter, nine millimeter, pop on, pop off plates. So this is what's called the Horizon Memory Craft 9450. The newest of the Janome's machines, you're gonna get bigger, bigger, bigger. This is the M7, Continental M7. 14 inches of space, amazing. This is in a table, but it does come with an extension table with the machine itself. Again, great screen, super duper heavy duty, or regular sewing. You have the auto lift, you have the cutter, you have the different plates, and really nice, nice features, um, such as automatic bobbin winding versus, so you can wind the bobbin while you're sewing. The last machine we have, this is more of a real super duper specialty machine, and this is going to be um, the HD9, heavy duty 9, straight Not stitch, open, no. super heavy duty, and you can, um, so leather, heavy fabrics, you want to do precision sewing, um, heavy duty, this is the HD9, okay? So, I hope you enjoyed my little tour. Um, I'm pretty proud of what we have here, and love to share it with you whether you're in the store or online. Um, we are going to be doing a Facebook Live next Wednesday um, at uh, 2.30 on the 11th next Wednesday. And also, you know, this I'm winging it today. You know me, I just start talking. I'm kind of winging it. I'd love to hear your comments. You know, if you, you know, email us, Facebook us, whatever. I just would love to hear your comments and see if you enjoyed this. Um, next week, I have some nice plans on some new projects and techniques and stuff to show you, like a new foot to show you how to work with your machines. So 
I hope you enjoyed and see you later.